Hi guys, this is another self-care video for the morning time. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Like, comment, and subscribe. I literally just woke up so my lips look a little crusty but don't mind that okay I'm not gonna lie I just started scraping my tongue and it makes such a big difference in my mouth hygiene so it's like the staple and I got these from Target I don't wash my face right when I wake up because I'm going to work out so I usually just wet my face with some cold water because it helps me wake up to change my clothes so that I can work out and I'm giving body baby you see me you see me can't forget to make up my bed I swear making up my bed makes me feel so productive because it's like I'm not gonna just go in the bed and lay down and not do nothing so I feel like making my bed helps me not lay in it and be lazy all day <music> breakfast before I worked out so I decided to make me a little snack which is tuna fish and crackers which is one of my favorite little you know snacks but let me know if you guys have like different options for snacks or lunch ideas after you guys work out Make sure y'all drinking y'all water too, okay? Water is very, very important. Peppermint soap makes you feel so fresh, especially after working out. I always like to use this in my butt crack area and under my arms. 
And after that, I like to use the St. Ives Soothing Body Wash, the oatmeal and shea butter scent. And this is so good for my skin, especially because I have sensitive skin and it gets the job done. It makes me feel clean and smell like shea butter, baby. If y'all watch all my self-care videos, y'all know I always use the Honey Pot Feminine Wash for your hoo-ha. And baby, this works so good. It's just a refreshing scent. It doesn't irritate or anything. So I love to use this on my vagina and my butt crack also. Of course, I'm going to be washing my face with the CeraVe Moisturizing um, Cleanser. And this works so good for my sensitive skin. Hi y'all, how y'all doing? I just got out the shower, washed my face, did something to my hair, like just brushed it out, put some water in it because I didn't really want to do much to it. Like when I have my natural hair, I really don't do much to it. I just keep it moisturized and oil you down. So I feel like that's like a major part in my self care is my hair. And I'm gonna show you guys one of my favorite oils that I use. Um, is these two oils right here is the main choice growth oil and the wild growth hair oil everybody know this is an OG right now like everybody knows this is OG for all the girls out there I use those two oils you know for my edges cuz that's a very important thing baby and um, what is what else where's my um hold on and the camille rose curl love moisture milk it has rice milk and macadamia oil it's a softening leave-in conditioning cream with light notes of macadamia nut and vanilla and this keeps my hair very moisturized and everything so i always use this one too i just noticed like when i be doing these videos i don't really talk about hair in my um my self-care videos because this is a journey for me like i just started getting really into my self-care stuff because i usually just use the same things don't do too much but i feel like it's very important to when you do something you're supposed to do that's part of self-care because you're making yourself grow and become a better person and a better you so right now i'm going to be taking my vitamins and i'm going to be um writing in my journal because i didn't write in my when i first woke up so i'm going to write in my journal and i'm going to like i said take my vitamins so let's go so the first vitamins that i take is the ashwagandha um pills and it's made with um, organic ashwagandha and black pepper. I really hope I'm saying this right. And it's an advanced mood support. It boosts clarity and calmness. It enhances energy and mood and supports restful sleep. I actually just started taking it, so I can't really tell y'all if it works right now. So this is like my third day taking it. So yeah. And I also take a biotin. You already know this is for hair, skin, and nail health. So baby, like I said, I gotta keep the edges. So you know you gotta take your vitamins always. And I take fish oil pills and it helps with heart support. I wanna get women or multivitamins, but I just ran out of mine, so I gotta re um get those. I'm probably gonna get the gummy ones, like I'm childish. So I like gummy vitamins because it just makes me wanna eat it. So I gotta get those, but right now I'm just gonna take these right now with my water. So hmm. to take my vitamins every day um i take two of each except for the fish oil you want let's get into taking care of our bodies all 2022 It's a little bit time later. I forgot to record an outro. So I just want to come on here to say thank you guys so much for watching to the end of this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. 
like comment and subscribe and i'll see you in my next video and i appreciate you guys watching bye